what's up everybody it's david here with tacos and wheels today i'm gonna be working on my uh, bmw x5 pretty much uh, ended up driving it and the water pump just blew let's see if i can show you guys there's a crack right there in the middle but yeah uh, today i'm gonna be replacing water pump radiator and fan the fan clutch seems to be good so i'm just gonna keep it that way and uh, hopefully everything works out good i just installed the water pump or the coolant hoses and the brand new radiator it's already installed so it's good to fill the engine with coolant now uh, the only thing missing right now is the fan clutch stuck in the old water pump and i just cannot take it off for some reason so i'm gonna buy some tools to remove this and install the belt, the fan, which is in here, and put it all back together. Okay, so pretty much the cabin air filter is on. Uh, all the plastics and everything that goes there, mostly just missing a nut there. But just to clarify, I did not take off the cabin air filter and all the plastics because of the water pump. I actually removed them because I also did the valley pan gasket that goes in between the heads underneath the intake. Today I'm going to be showing you what I did yesterday on my X5. I uh, pretty much changed the water pump, the radiator and I still need to install the fan clutch and the fan. I need to order the fan clutch uh, tool so that I can remove it from the old water pump because it was pretty much broken in half. Uh, today I just got home from picking up a, a little bit of cars that we just bought it's a Corvette RX-7 and a Chevelle and for Sal he got himself uh, two Beetles and came in extra with a little Ford older more model I'm today I'm gonna also be watching my car because it's really 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 dirty and we're going to a car show later tonight so it has to be clean for that as you can see I'm in my black BMW convertible and this is the one we're gonna we're gonna take for that uh, most likely also just probably gonna show you a little bit of the cars I have at home like my f-150 and my uh, x5 the one I was working on yesterday so let's go this is the truck I was working on yesterday it's my 2002 BMW x5 it's the V8 all wheel drive with a silver outside and gray interior. We were driving it somewhere and the water pump just decided to blow like it basically broke into pieces. So that was what I was doing yesterday. I actually replaced the water pump um, and the radiator, brand new radiator. Also have the brand new fan but the fan clutch decided to stay on the older water pump so i cannot really take it off i'm gonna have to buy some tools to remove that right now i'm only waiting for that tool so i can start mounting everything properly like the intake and the washer fluid reservoir pretty much after that it's gonna be good just need to fill the coolant with the the engine with coolant and that it, it should be good to go and then this is my 1994 f-150 it's the six in line 4.9 liter it's a manual truck under this cover right here it's my nissan 300 cx twin turbo shell no engine no transmission pretty much i bought the car so i could build it completely from ground up and i have some experience with this cars before i used to daily one for a while and i sold it so now i really want to build one so stay tuned for more content for this car just want to start working on it once i get all the projects out of the way like the x5 here and the bmw m3 that i have inside the garage but once that's done the 300 cx is gonna come out probably gonna go in the garage and we're gonna start working on it 
Okay guys, so the cars I haven't really mentioned on this video, it's my BMW M3 and my 2014 Camaro. The M3 is in the garage, obviously it uh, needs a little bit of work. I'm actually doing the manual swap and my uh, black interior swap. So I'm in the process of buying all the parts for the manual swap, so stay tuned for that. And I also have my 2014 Camaro, which I'm in right now. It's my wife's daily, she takes this to work, she takes this to the groceries. We use this car for everything pretty much. We just came back from a trip from Northern Arizona. We went to visit the family and the car is full of bugs, it's full of dirt. So I'm about to wash it, I'm in the car wash right now. If you have any more questions about cars, about the wagon, about the 300CX or the M3, maybe even the F-150, I don't know. Uh, let us know, comment on below, comment on YouTube, follow us on Instagram, maybe send us a message through Messenger or Facebook or whatever. Uh, there's always going to be more room to improve, so let us know what we can do better, what we can do worse, or anything that we can do to make this channel grow, make this channel better. Everybody have a good day, and please like and subscribe. Don't forget to like this video. Thank you for watching.